Right, we're at SM and we've just been to SM to see one of our subscribers, yeah, Larry. Is Larry. Thank you. Yeah, and he's uh, bought us some lunch and a, and a drink and we've had a really long chat. Now, Larry's left his uh, Filipino wife in the US and because um, she's had to work and he's come over here for a couple of weeks he's looking around for somewhere to live he's not 100% sure where he wants to live in the Philippines yet but he does like Naga and this is his second trip I believe to Naga so uh, we've exchanged phone numbers and next time he comes he's going to get in in touch it's uh, really busy in SM Sorry I can't do any video in there guys but um, they won't allow you to video and it's it's like I said before it's a lot of stress to try and get past the guards with the camera even though it's quite quite small um, Now what I didn't do on the last video was say thank you to my patrons which are the main guys who support us financially and we really appreciate it we've lost quite a few sub, uh, patrons lately guys so if you've been thinking of supporting us on patreon now would be a good time and uh, again thanks very much to all our patrons and the long time supporters on patreon you know who you are and our new ones of course so it's a special day today isn't it babe I'm excited. Me too. Tell them, tell them why we're excited. Um, we, will have, we will go to. We will go to. Oh. <laughs> we will go to. For ultrasound. We're going for the ultrasound. I hope it's a boy. To see whether it's a girl or boy, <laughs> but with it only been five months, I would. I always assumed it was six months for an ultrasound. The last um, time that I'm ultrasound for my kids is just for five months. Right. Because they can't always tell though at five months. You know, if the baby's in an awkward position or whatever, yeah. it could um, could stop them telling. Matthew, so, are you having a baby brother or baby girl? So we'll yeah. soon know. Hey, <laughs> look at them ears. <laughs> so we'll know in a little bit, guys, and so will you. So see you in a mouth. <laughs> so we're in the clinic for the ultrasound <clears throat> and Mal's just gone up to the um, secretary and she's asked how many months she is and Mal says I'm five months and she says well it should really be six months for an ultrasound <laughs> Mal says no it's okay I got it done it five last time yeah. now I say to Mal it's normally six months but does she listen? No. No, because the last time like, we had an ultrasound from Matthew, I asked the doctor and I asked her if how many months can I go to ultrasound and she said five months. Oh. Ah. Yes. Yeah, but what if what if the leg's in the way or something and you can't we will do it see? Again. We will do it again. Oh yeah. <laughs> Where's all the ultrasound money coming from? I don't want to sound uh, curry pot, but you know. So, what is your decision? What? You I'm going to go with you, baby, if you want it done now. Because I know how excited you are. <laughs> no, I'm not excited. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> so it's a nice little room here. And we've got to wait for the doctors because they're on the dinner break, but it looks like they have a two hour dinner break then. No, because it's not uh, exact eating that's slow. If, if the patient's alert, it will be mm. late. There you go. So I'm, we're just going to wait for the doctor. I'm like on clinic before, right? That's what I know. Sometimes I'm late now to it, like one, two. Mm -hmm. It depends if a lot of patients. God, I bet that sent you crazy, didn't it, Mel? <laughs> you there's, couldn't eat. There's no break time. Oh, 
So there's no definite break time in the Philippines then? No, it depends. So like in the, in the, uh, in the, uh, in government, they have a, uh, uh, they have break time, but here in clinic, no. No. We need to, to finish all the patients before you eat. Before you eat. For your app? Yeah. For your app. Okay. There's uh, the, uh, it's a uh, morning schedule and then they have a afternoon, afternoon schedule. Afternoon schedule. Yeah. See, I knew that. Isn't that funny? So, the next thing will be the ultrasound, but she's not going to tell me what it is. Yeah, it's a Until Sunday. Sunday. I will Why prepare. Sunday? Because I will prepare. Oh, she wants to do this balloon thing. Yeah, balloon thing, and then you will pump it, right? I will pump it. You want that? I don't know about pumping it. No, yeah, let's see. Oh, though. so I will give you a clue. If if the paper is uh, <laughs> is uh, blue, it means it's a girl. <laughs> if it's pink, means it's a boy. Okay. I think you've got it all backwards, Mel. Pink's a girl and blue's a boy. Just to make you crazy. Yeah, well, you make me crazy anyway, don't you? Come out with some art stuff. So, that's it till the doctors come by. Yeah. So, this is the the Right, we've only just come out of the clinic and we arrived here at, it was 10 to 2 actually, 10 to 2, it's now 10 to 6. We were sat there from 10 to 2 till 25 to 6 for the doctor to come. And we've only just come out, I am absolutely worn out. Um, we were hoping to be able to tell you what the sex of the child is but unfortunately the the baby's in breach and the doctor couldn't uh, see the gender so we're not going to try and guess what it is the doctor give us give us her opinion what it was but we don't want to jump to conclusions so we're going to leave it till the next scan yeah. and we're going to get off home now because we're very tired take, uh, yeah um, the good news was for me is the doctor give me a prescription for smart blood tablets I just said can you give me a prescription and she give me a prescription so I've I've getting a prescription where I'm to go and pay for a doctor and pay for the pay for the uh, prescription from the doctor so something good come of it as well so that cost us 1050 pesos just for your information if your wife ever gets pregnant that's what roughly what you're gonna have to pay So it's not always the same price, ma'am? Okay. Depends. So... The first time that we've been, when it's 
so that's it from a very tired day we need to get home because I'm really tired I was I was falling asleep in there I really was and my bum went numb and he's had enough he was he's been really groggy hasn't he babe because he did he got about 10 minutes sleep after his bottle so over to you babe Yes. So till the next video guys. See you all soon. Lions roaring in the morning sun. Searching for a longer day. People feeling like the light has just come. We must never stop the way. Birds jumping and I hear my name Grasping into a life Life is happy